Ezekiel receives his message. When I saw it, I fell upon my face, and I heard a voice of the one that spoke. And he said to me, Son of man, stand upon thy feet, and I will speak to thee. Then the Spirit entered into me when he spoke to me, and set me upon my feet, and I heard him that spoke to me. And he said to me, Son of man, I send thee to the children of Israel, to a rebellious nation that have rebelled against me. They and their fathers have transgressed against me, even to this very day. For they are an impudent children and stiff-hearted. I send thee to them, and thou shalt say to them, Thus saith the Lord, and they say, Whether they will hear, or whether they will forbear. For they are a rebellious house, yet shall know that there has been a prophet among them. And thou, son of man, be not afraid of them, neither be afraid of their words. O briars and thorns be with thee, and thou dost dwell among scorpions. Be not afraid of their words, nor be dismayed at their looks, though they be a rebellious house. And thou shalt speak my words to them, whether they will hear, or whether they will forbear, for they are most rebellious. But thou, son of man, hear what I say to thee. Be not thou rebellious, like that rebellious house. Open thy mouth, and eat what I give thee. And when I looked, behold, a hand was sent to me, and lo, a roll of a book was therein, and he spread it before me, and it was written within and on the back, and there were written therein lamentations and mourning and woe. Moreover, he said to me, Son of man, eat what thou findest, eat this roll, and go, speak to the house of Israel. So I opened my mouth, and he made me eat this roll. Then did I eat it, and it was sweet as honey in my mouth. And the Spirit took me up, and I heard behind me a voice of a great rushing, saying, Blessed be the glory of the Lord from this place. Blessed be the glory of the Lord from his place. I heard also the noise of the wings of the living creatures that touched one another, and the noise of wheels beside them, a noise of great rushing. So the Spirit lifted me up and took me away, and I went in bitterness, in the heat of my spirit. But the hand of the Lord was strong upon me, and I came to them of the captivity that dwelt by the river, and I sat where they sat, and remained there dumbfounded among them for seven days. And it came to pass at the end of the seven days that the word of the Lord came to me, saying, I have made thee a watchman to the house of Israel. Therefore hear the word of my mouth, and give them warning from me. When I say to the wicked, Thou shalt surely die, and thou giveth him not warning, nor speaketh to warn the wicked from his wicked ways, to save his life, the same wicked man shall die in his iniquity but his blood will I require at his hand. Yet if thou warn the wicked, and he turn not from his wickedness, nor from his wicked way, he shall die in his iniquity, but thou hast delivered thy very soul. God have mercy, and Jesus have mercy, Christ have mercy on us all.